Hello guys, it's Tom from Trainsim TV. Thank you for uh, joining us for another video. Today we've got a tutorial on how to make your roots appear in RW tools. It's a very simple process. Um, we get loads of people asking us, and rather than replying back on the videos how to do so, we might as well make a video and show you. We can just point you into the right direction so you can watch and actually see it done. So you need to have RW tools open for, which is this one on the right here. Always make sure you've got up to your most up to date version. I don't actually think I am, but I'm not far from the most up to date one. Um, but anyway, if we head over to scenarios and we want to edit a scenario on Riviera Lines, you would go down here and then look for R. And as you can see, we've got Riviera Lines in the 50s, but not the original one, which we, we want. To make this appear, we then need to shut this down, go to your root directory. So go to Steam, Steam Apps, Common, Railworks, Content, and Roots. You need the root ID which is the long number, as you can see in all these different ones, they're all different routes. Um, to find the actual route ID, you can go into the train sim itself and go into build option and then over highlight the route and you can click the little open button on the right hand side in the game and it'll actually take you to the folder so you can find the route ID in the top of the um, directory string here. But we've got the right ID already so we're going to go click here and then paste it in. As you can see there it is, that, this is the Riviera Lines ID. So when you open the folder it will be empty and it will just have the main content AP. It won't have all what you can see here. Unless you have the scenario packs as well. Any AP files will be here, but apart from that the top folders wouldn't be showing to get them. There you can actually extract the whole thing if you wish to do so, there's no need to. To make the root show you need to simply click and then right click and open with 7zip. Always make sure you have 7zip, it's the best one um, in my opinion to do this. You want to find the root properties.xml and just simply drag it into there close down the archive that's that now if we go back into scenarios edit scenarios I'll have a look down in here and we can now see that the route is now appeared you can do this with any um, route that's come from steam um, routes externally add to my knowledge none of them ex actually need that uh, process doing they'll already show up um, if you've created your own route, it'll automatically show it's just anything off the Steam store um, that has the AP file you have to extract it to make it appear. Um, you can just extract every single one if you wish to do so. Um, but basically then you can see all the scenarios and you can edit in if you wish to do so, like changing stock or whatever. Um, so thank you very much for watching, I hope it's been beneficial. Um, please always refer to it if you need to do so. Don't forget to drop us a subscribe um, on YouTube. Please come and watch us over at Twitch as well, twitch.tv forward slash trainsomtv underscore tom or trainsomtv underscore mark. Um, do drop us a follow and I uh, hope to see you soon. Thank you very much for watching and catch you again on the next one. Bye guys.